第三十三对表演的题目是 Fly to the South with all our heart. 计时开始。To the TV news, and in the interest of international friendship, as well as the integration of our new residents, the government has launched the new South Bone policy. This program focuses on helping everyone use exchange, languages, and cultural understanding, while also providing an opportunity for people to learn and grow into their citizenship in Taiwan. Let's take a break. Hey, mom! Mom! Yes? Did you watch the news? Yeah. And do you think I should do the program? Do what? One of the program of the new southbound policy. The new southbound policy? Yes. I think I think it would be really good for you. International travel and serving others is one of the best things a young person can do. You are helping with your growing way that you can fly here. The life you touch and the good you do will continue on long after you live. And it would be good for you to visit the home of your grandmother. So this is really going to happen, isn't it? I think so. There is a lot to do to plan and apply, but yes, I think it's going to happen. Yay! I'm going to Vietnam. Let's go and prepare for yeah, it. Yeah, sure. Welcome to Dan Shan Yap Airport. The local time is 7:38. Taiwan. 
Finally, we got to be together after 20 years. In Chinese, we have a phrase, 四海之内皆兄弟. In Vietnamese, it's 合成一個來幫. Yeah, it's really, it's true. We really are the same. We care about our loved ones, our future, our education, and we all try to live so that we and the people we love are all happy. And happiness comes from finding loved ones and being with them, even if at first they're an ocean away. Thank you! 第三十四对表演的题目是 We Are Family. 计时开始。As we all know, Taiwan and Southeast Asia share lots of similarities. In ancient times, Austronesian and Chinese people both traveled to these regions and developed abundant civilization. Yes, and nowadays there is also a considerable number of migrant workers here in Taiwan. Ka, Ka, Wiser, your head shouldn't wait like that. It's really funny. Yes, Wiser. It's a presentation, not a comedy. And Lindy, could you please stop talking like a robot? Put more emotion in your speech. Okay, I will try, but honestly, we don't know much about Southeast Asia. Me neither. I'm more fond of European cultures. Um, frankly speaking, I so much doubt the feasibility of this competition we are attending to stimulate exchanges between Taiwan young generation and Southeast Asians, I just don't see a motive. Really? Simply you don't know what is going on? Enough, enough. How about this? Let's part and think more about these topics and come over with some new ideas. Good idea. Everyone, how about us meeting next Monday? Okay. 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 So, what are we going to do now? Well, we'll figure it out. Hey, I have a good idea. Do you want to listen? Sure, how it would be helpful. Of course it would be. Since we live in a high-tech era, I think we can set up a website to enable some sort of direct interaction. Sounds excellent. In this website, we can not only introduce historical relationship in these two regions, and but also we can exchange knowledge about our abundant cultures. Yeah, and apart from that, we can also promote products from these two regions on the website that shows the cultures and customs of their homeland, like postcards and clothing. It will also work if we can simultaneously post a few day news and interesting facts about these two regions in order to improve our mutual understanding. Yeah, and in addition, we can also found tutoring systems for Southeast Asian languages so that we can provide multilingual information and everyone will be able to understand it. By doing this, we're bound to have rich ex exchanges in many aspects. Yes. Wow, that is really a huge blow. Yeah, that's terrible. You know what? We are peace lover. I think we should leave now. Wow, do you know what was going on? Yes, it seems like a Taiwanese and a Filipino were fighting. Oh. And have you heard what they said? Mm, yes, a Taiwanese called that Filipino a monkey. Wow, so sad. Obviously, there are still some problems between them and us waiting to be solved. Yeah, you're right. I even heard someone says that Philippines oh. is a backward country. He should really go to Manila and experience their poverty. Yeah, <laughs> that is sarcastic. And there are also many Taiwanese who consider themselves superior than those Southeast Asians mm. and don't treat them like how they treat Westerners. Yeah, the fundamental difference between why Lao, migrant worker, Lao, why, Westerners. <laughs> You've got a point. And I think this prejudice shouldn't exist in Taiwan anymore. Yeah, you're right. Hey, you know, I think this is why our government is holding this competition to eliminate misunderstanding and thus discrimination. Everyone in the world should be respected. Yeah, you're right. Hey, here is some chair. Let's sit down and rest. Oh, hi. Hey, oh. nice to meet you here. Oh, oh scare me. Oh, these chairs work. Okay, so 
we are eager to tell you about our ideas considering um, the, a website. Oh wait, Darius and I also want to tell you how we finally think about this competition. Yes. Mm, okay. Yes, please begin. So as Paul and I were hanging out, we noticed there are some problems Southeast Asia may face in Taiwan. Indeed. Misunderstandings do deeply hurt the friendship between our people. And the only way to conquer this world is to create a bridge, which allows us to have more mutual understanding and cherish the relationship we share. Marvelous. Mm, I think it's time to give our project a name for this competition. Yes, how about We Are Family? Hey, that's a good name. Yeah, it indicates that only when we learn to respect and love each other like a family can we work together peacefully and achieve a better future for us all. We're making a slogan, right? Yes. How about mm, the Mother Earth we share, the destiny we care? Sounds good to me. A good one. So, the destiny we bear, the Mother Earth we care. We are family. family. Go, 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 go. Thank you. 第三十五对表演的题目是 Generations Light Up， 计时开始。You're still wasting time on your phone. Mom, now everything is about social networking and modern technology. You don't understand. What I do understand is you are not studying. Your older brother Peter is almost done with med school, and he is volunteering in Vietnam. Comparing me with your precious Peter? I'm never good enough, huh? Isabel, after you finish your homework, you can do anything you want. Here we go again. Is anyone home? I will get the door, and you watch your attitude. What's your attitude? Terry, your son's in Vietnam, right? Yeah. My husband, he... My husband went for a work project in Vietnam, and I haven't heard from him in a week. I saw on the news that there's been a terrible outbreak of dengue fever in the area, and I haven't been able to contact him. It's gonna be okay. Isabel, call your brother. Okay, let's come and sit down. Peter's not answering. Let me text him to see if he can help. Later on that day, Daddy. Peter calls back. Mom! Mom! Peter's calling! Hey, Mom! Mom! We found Summer's husband! He's safe! That's wonderful! Really? Thanks, Peter! No problem, Auntie Summer! I'm gonna go home and tell my kids your dad is safe! Bye! Take care, Auntie Summer! Hey. It's serious. Over 100,000 cases have been reported this year, and they need volunteers. Between all the different health programs, we have a lot of resources. What we need is, is a faster way to distribute them. Exactly. And you're someone who could solve this problem. Me? Yeah, you. With your tech skills, you'll be helping us and a new cell phone policy. Here we need. You. But how exactly? In this information era, she could build a website. Yeah, I can definitely do it. Let's do it, Isabel. I'll be with you no matter what. Me too. Gotta go. Love you. Bye. 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 Take care. Mom, I'm hungry. Could you make me dinner? Sure. I'll call you when it's ready. Thanks, Mom. All right, let's do it. That's Starfront Southeast Asia, which is the target region of our new South Bond policy. Peter's got a point. I can create a website. Lots of people are making live videos and microfilms now. Anyone can become a citizen journalist and post the latest news on the site. A forum would be a great idea. With different people and professional assistance from corporations and NGOs, we can find solutions to problems any place after a disaster. Hey, we should have a tab where relief organizations could post requests where volunteers can contact them. And we're going to need money to make things happen. Oh my gosh, this website's going to be so good. It's going to need a spectacular name. I want all generations to work together. And I want this to be the spark that starts a fire. So I'm going to name it Generations Light Up. I just can't believe 
David. Oh, it's starting now. Good evening, and welcome to Taiwan tonight. Tonight's guests are Generations Light Up. Two years ago, they created a website. Let's hear more. Thank you, Ting. It's an honor to be here. It all began with an outbreak of dengue fever in Southeast Asia. Our auntie Summer almost lost her husband, so we needed to do something. So my sister and I created a website in order to help people to solve dengue fever problems or other disasters worldwide. By combining our ideas about issues, people can come up with answers together. As responsible netizens, people all over the world can easily understand what's happening. The website is accessible for most computers and phones. Anytime, anywhere. It's a comprehensive approach to the problem. The new southbound policy has earned a lot of goodwill for Taiwan in Southeast Asia. By helping our neighbors, we provide for our own future. Just like a farmer who plants seeds wisely in a deep soil. I see you want the new southbound policy to grow successfully like those seeds. Let's stay global minded and do everything we can to support each other. That's what the New South Farm policy is all about. Well, thank you. That's all for tonight. I'm Zi Ting, and we'll see you next time. Together, Taiwan will be a to the brighter future for everyone. GLU, New Generation Sign Up. Thank you. 第三十六对表演的题目是 Different Eating Patterns. 计时开始 In the campus. Excuse me, could you give me a hand? Sure, what's wrong? Well, my name is Adam. I am from Vietnam. I am a new student in this school. Oh, cool. Nice to meet you. My name is Bill. I am a second grade student. Nice to meet you too. Could you give me a hand, Bill? Of course. Where is building C? I am looking for my classroom. The building C is over there. Why not just follow me? I will take you there. Let me help you with the luggage. Thank you very much. It's so nice of you. At the corner of the student's cafeteria, In a fancy restaurant. Ah, it's nice we can gather together here today. Sure. Thank you for taking me here to test all authentic Taiwanese food. You're welcome. Let's order some delicious traditional dish for you. Thanks. I can't wait. Waitress. Waitress. 
This is our menu. Have you ever come here before? Yes, we have. Can we order now? Of course. Mm, we like to have bamboo shoot soup, mapo tofu, sweet and the sour pork, and the fried cabbage. Sorry, mm, excuse me, Bill. We mere tenants don't eat bamboo shoots. We are easily allergic to it. Also, we don't eat tofu. Well, we main food in well affect our certain body function. Wow, really? I have no idea. Then how do you like to eat? Your tenant boys like to eat meat, while girls like to eat vegetables. Okay, I see. Sorry, instead of bamboo shoot soup and maple tofu, we want to have meatball soup, sliced chicken with sweet soy bean pads, and uh, stew beef. Thank you guys, I am happy that you can accept and respect our different eating patterns. Of course, we should embrace our similarities and tolerate our difference at the same time. That's the plan for everyone.